are you? I hope you are fine. Today it's time for a new story for a new book. Let's begin. It's called Cuddle Up Tight. Night, night, Teddy, says the girl. Cuddle up tight. Every night, when I'm ready for bed, I tuck my teddy up right here on my pillow. But tonight it's stormy outside and Teddy is scared. See, he's closing his eyes. He's scared. See, it's stormy. Teddy wants big, brave, spotty leopard because leopards aren't scared of anything. They are very brave. Night, night, Teddy. Night, night, spotty leopard. Cuddle up tight. But Spotty Leopard says that she cannot go sleep without her best friend, Elephant. Night, night, Teddy. Night, night, Spotty Leopard. Night, night, Elephant. Cuddle up tight. But Elephant says Zebra is not feeling well. Oh, look, she's sick. So the girl says, open wide, Zebra, you'll be all better in the morning. Night, night, Teddy. Night, night, Spotty Leopard. Night, night, Elephant. Night, night, Zebra. Cuddle up tight. Now everyone wants a bedtime story. So our girl needs a book to read a story. Settle down, please. It's story time, not wriggle about time. So they are sitting in the bed and she is reading a book. Now it's time to go to sleep after story. But dinosaurs left all on his own. Don't worry, dinosaur. We'll feed you in somehow. There. Now everyone is in. Teddy, Spotty Leopard, Zebra and Dinosaur. We haven't forgotten anyone, have we? Is everybody here? Wait, but what about me? Everyone out from my bed. See? So... The girl decided that she will sleep in her bed without a dinosaur, without a zebra, elephant and the leopard. Everyone must leave her bed. Now everyone is cozy again. So I'll get into bed. See, all animals are sleeping together and our girl went to her bed. But first I'll just tuck Teddy up right here on my pillow so i've got someone to cuddle all night 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 teddy night night me cuddle up tight now guys i'm going to show you uh, the story which we read cuddle up tight this is our girl and she's ready to go to bed she took her teddy and she's putting him in his bed on the pillow and she's cuddling him outside in bed. But today it's very stormy and our bear is scared and he says that he needs a leopard because leopard is very, very brave. He's not scared of bad weather and of storm and of rain. So our girl is putting a leopard into the bed with the teddy he's not afraid anymore and he's ready to sleep so she's cuddling them up tight under the blanket and what happens next our big and brave leopard says that he cannot sleep without his friend who is his friend who remembers it's an elephant so now Leopard is very happy because his friend Elephant can sleep in bed. So our girl, she's cuddling them up tight in bed again. 
Now there are three of them on the pillow. She cuddled them up tight and they are ready to sleep. And she says, cuddle up tight. And she says, night, night, teddy bear. Night, night, leaper. Night, night, elephant. But elephant says that zebra is not feeling well. She is sick and we need to take her to bed too. So, our girl wants to take care and she says open wide and she's giving the medicine to zebra and she says that everything will be okay and tomorrow you will get better so you need just to rest well and she's cuddling up tight a zebra now and she says night night teddy bear night night leopard night night elephant night night zebra but somebody is missing. Who is it? It's a big dinosaur. A dinosaur is missing. And she's cuddling him up tight in bed too. Is everybody here? Nobody's missing. Everybody is in bed. But dinosaur wants a story, a night story story before going to sleep. So girl takes a book and they are sitting all together and she begins to read a night uh, story for them. So she finished reading the story and she says night night to everybody. Night night teddy bear. Night, night, leader, leopard. Night, night, elephant. Night, night, dinosaur. Night, night, zebra. Night, night, me. But wait, there is no place for me to sleep. Now everybody's out, and all the animals are going away out of the bed. And our girl is cuddling up tight in her bed. But wait, where is my teddy? Here it is. Now I have somebody to cuddle at night. Night, night. Now guys, we're going to do a task. We have a sick teddy bear. See, he's sick. He has a plaster on his head. And we need to put other plasters um, on his body. Uh, we have capital letters and we have here plasters with uh, lowercase letters. Uh, first, we need to take the scissors and cut out the plasters. Okay, guys, hope you are ready. So let's help our teddy bear. Let's start with his uh, body, with the letters which we have on his body. Uh, we have first letter R. Yes, so we have here uppercase. We need to find the plaster with lowercase letter R. Mm, where is it? Here it is. And stick it on the uppercase. Letter R sound R. R R. Next letter which we have on the body of our teddy bear is letter T. Letter T sound T. Now let's find lowercase letter T. Here is the right cluster. And let's stick it on the upper. Hope. Done. And letter V. Letter V sound V. Here is the plaster. Blue and stick. Okay. R, T and V. Now let's go to his right pole. We have here two letters. First, I think it's easy for you. Letter S. That's right, letter S, uppercase, and now let's find the plaster with lowercase. Here it is. Letter S, sound S. That's right. Letter S and letter B. Mm -hmm. Letter B, where is lowercase? Here it is. B, sound O. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sound P. Now let's go to the left hand, left arm of our teddy bear. We have here a letter O. 
letter O uppercase and here is letter O lowercase. Letter O sound O. Okay. Ready? And one more letter which we have on the left uh, arm. It's letter X. Letter X and lowercase is the same as the uppercase. Letter X sound X. X, X. And now let's go to his legs and feet. Let's start with the left one. Uh, this is letter N. That's right, letter N. We need to find lowercase. Here it is. Letter N sound N. N sound N. Next, what letter is it? Letter U. Letter U gives us three sounds. A, U and U. Here is uppercase and this is lowercase. Okay, and the last on this, uh, on the feet, on the foot, we have letter W. Letter W sound W. Not V like letter V gives, but sound W, like in the word window, for example. Uppercase and lowercase, they are almost the same. Here it is. Letter W sound W. Next, we are going to the right leg. We have here letter Z. Mm -hmm. Letter Z sound Z. Uppercase and we are sticking the plaster with lowercase. Done. Letter Z sound Z. Next goes letter Q. Mm -hmm. Letter Q sound Q. Usually it goes with letter U and they make sound Q. Okay, this is uppercase and here is lowercase letter Q. Here it is. We read it like Q. And the last plaster which we need to put on our poor teddy bear, it will be the plaster with letter Y. That's right, letter Y uppercase and letter Y lowercase. Usually it gives us sound U. Like in the word yellow, for example. Okay, we stuck all the plasters on our teddy bear and we will hope that he will get better. Now, guys, um, I'm going to see you soon about a teddy bear and I hope if you have a teddy bear, please take and sing with me. Okay, let's go. My teddy bear has two eyes. Two eyes, two eyes, my teddy bear has two eyes. I love my teddy bear. My teddy bear has one nose, one nose, one nose. My teddy bear has one nose. I love my teddy bear. My teddy bear has two ears, two ears, two ears. My teddy bear has Two ears, I love my teddy bear. My teddy bear has one mouth, one mouth, one mouth. My teddy bear has one mouth, I love my teddy bear. My teddy bear has two arms, two arms, two arms. My teddy bear has two arms, I love my teddy bear. My teddy bear has two legs, two legs, two legs. My teddy bear has two legs. I love my teddy bear. Your story about a teddy bear and now you have a chance to make your own teddy bear from a towel. This is how he is going to Okay, first you need to bend it like this. So we'll have like three parts. This one, this and this. And then start rolling it very tight from one side till the middle, not till the end. Roll it like this. Take something heavy to fix it. 
and start rolling from the other side. Okay. Okay, now turn it over and take this part and turn it like this and open carefully. Now hold it, hold it like this and take a rubber band or your band for here and put it on our bear to make head. Now see, he has two legs and two hands. This is his body. And now we need two more rubber bands. Let's take this to make ears. So you take a little piece here and see, now we have a little ear like this. One and a little here will be here too. You can even make it twice like this. One and one more little like this. And something happened with our head. Let's take now, we have two ears, we have here hands, legs, and now you are taking your ribbon and put it around the rubber band, which we took many times, put it tight and make a bow. Now your teddy bear is ready. You can put it in your bedroom or in your bathroom.